Part 2. Planning. Before writing any essay, planning is key. To do this, you must first study the graph and find key features such as comparisons, main changes and unusual trends. Let's study comparison part. In the bar chart, always look for the highest and lowest. But in our case, we have different in terms of numbers and time periods. So it's a good idea to consider difference in the beginning period and then end period. At the start of the period, Australia shows the highest emigrated country than the rest of the countries. Surprisingly, this is also the case in the end period 2007. When it comes to general trends, almost all countries had declined over the period except Australia again. Australia had increased, Spain, New Zealand had declined, USA also declined despite of the fluctuations, France had dropped as well, although it had a peak in 2005. So these are the key changes and the main trends that you are going to report on this task. After identifying key features, you just have to organize essay structure. There is no best structure, obviously, but the most common is written as introduction, overview, and details. The body part can be either two or three paragraphs. Part three, overview. Overview is basically writing general trends and the difference. In previous chapter, we have gone through main trends. Here, you have to write all of these main trends in a clear and concise way. Now, let's have a look at the sample. It says, throughout the period, immigration to almost all countries had declined except to Australia. This is exactly what we discussed in previous section. In addition, it includes Australia as the highest of all. That's all you need to mention in overview. You don't need to mention data, years, as those are discussed in the details part.